So what, we got a UPC barcode, everything? Is that how it's gonna be? Everything, just our foreheads. Why don't we just scan our heads while we're in the supermarket? I think that's a good way to go. Good way to go, America. Good job. What happened to cash? Can't we just get cash? When you pay for something, take out your wallet and pay in cash. That'd be very nice if we did that. And there should be some road work done in the valley. In Albuquerque. Valley there. But, um, maybe, uh, um, I have a car. Welcome. Today's edition of the Patrick McAlee Fun Time Happy Hour, Half Hour Comedy Hour, Super Crazy Accordion Time. And for those of you who just missed that, that's okay, because we've got a very special song that we like to sing to each and every single one of you. Well, maybe not you. <laughs> well, okay. It's Patrick McAlee's Fun Time Happy Hour, Half Hour Comedy Hour. It's Patrick Mackle, we spend time at the hour, half that we're coming the hour. Super crazy accordion time, super crazy accordion time. Great. Well, on today's show, it's a very, very special show, as they always are. And that show, and the reason that it's so special is because, well, our entire band has passed away, and it's just, <laughs> we're just so happy that we're mourning their loss. So join us on today's show. <laughs> oh look, it's Eric Peterson, the most boring man on the planet. Hello Eric Peterson, how are you? Oh, I, I think things are good. Do you have an itch or something? <laughs> What's going no, on? I don't. I, I think... But uh, things are good today. Huh. Except for the whole band dying thing. Yes, that's... Please don't mention that again. Don't mention the band dying? Stop it. Oh, you want me to stop? Stop. Right. Yes. So, um, also we have guests on today's show. And today's first guest is going to be um, a uh, person that we all know and love and has a mouth and nose with words that come out of them. And not the nose, but mouth. <laughs> Uh, producer. Yes. Uh, yes. Um, who who are, who am I interviewing? Today? Um, see, that's the thing. They they They're couldn't not... show up today, but this is what they would have worn. That's if they would have shown up. So did you get that from my closet? Yeah, I did. Maybe, but this is what they would have worn because you requested it, but they didn't show. So can you interview them? Uh, yes, I love this guy, woman, and um. <laughs> So, uh, what's, uh, what's new with you? Um, <laughs> yes, yes, Pennsylvania is a crazy state. Do we have anybody from Pennsylvania? Yes, yes, great. And uh, are, you, um, are you a big fan of the potted meat? The potted meat, the potted meat. <laughs> um, oh, potted meat is good. Yes, I just hope. Eric Peterson, <laughs> who do you think you're fooling? Um, do, do, does our audience, does our, no! I'm sorry about that, to be treated so callously as such a beautiful, beautiful woman as you. Oh my god, your skeleton is popping out of your frame, out of your body. Skeleton body, here come out. This is great. Um, can we go to a commercial break? Action! Ah, sweet water. H2O. There's nothing better for quenching your thirst on a hot summer's... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat>
<laughs> Hi. Hi. Um, looks like we have another guest on the show today, whose name is... Hi. I I'm, don't know who she is. I'm Sicily. She I'm Sicily from Massachusetts. Sicily. And I think it's super to be here. It's great that you made it here. Jeff, you said you don't know this person? The other came in from off the street. Eric, why didn't you stop him? Great. Eric, the most boring man on the planet. Oh, well, that's why we hired you, Shadow Man. So how do you play that thing? Well, what you do is you take your fingers, uh -huh. and you first have to give them a little magic kiss on each finger. Uh-huh. Magic finger uh -huh. kiss. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. My god, have you been eating lots of red meat? It's my lipstick. Oh, your lipstick. Delicious. Can I get a napkin? Napkin, Eric Peterson. Here, you can use my, so. my dress. It's OK. It's an apron. It's made for cleaning things up. This is wonderful. This is this is better than that cruise I went on to the Bahamas, the Bermuda Hamas. I went to the ha Bahamas. The Hotmas, the Mahatma Gandhi's. Yes. I love them. I did. You been there? Only once. I dropped my shoe. Oh no. Oh, I dropped my hat. Oh no. Oh no. Here, that wear damn my hat. Gravity. Wear oh my hat. yes. I love hats. I like shoes. Do we have a sponsor for this I hat? I like shoes. Is there a reason I'm wearing this hat? It's my hat. It is your hat, so why yes. am I wearing your hat? Because you fell off my head. Yes, just like Legos. Just like I Legos. like Legos. You can make things out of them. Oh boy, what do you like to make out of Legos? I like I'm sorry, no there's, there's some weird person who came in off the street and I don't know where they are and I can't find them. Eric Peterson! Where's your hat? Excuse me, I'm reprimanding Eric Peterson. Where's his hat? Oh my god. Yeah? I can't what? even reprimand my friend Eric Peterson. This is hard. Hold on. You dropped your hat. You dropped Here, a hat, I dropped a hat, everybody's dropping Here. a hat. Yes? Hey, do I recognize <laughs> from somewhere? Yes, mother. Was it from Sunnydale and Shane Asylum? No, I'm doing the show. No. No, my show. Wait. Oh. What? No, that show doesn't Because I've lived in Sunnydale and Shane Asylum for the past 25 years. Can't you see years. a man is on the phone? See, I don't think I remember much from, from when I was there. This is infuriating. I, I like phones. Anything from when I was there. I haven't had a phone oh. in years. God, I get her off me! Help! <laughs> Um, it's great to have you on the good. show, Sicily. You were Sicily. Sicily. And thank you for joining us. It's a pity and a pleasure that you have. To... Sure. Can I have my hat? Oh! You chased her off. <laughs> I chased her off. Eric Peterson. Oh. What? Well, look who's here. Why? Who's here? Oh. Why? It's, I'm sorry, what was your name again? The artist formerly known as Dewage. That's right, artist formerly known as Dewage, right here on our very own set. I'm, I'm just so excited wow. to have you here. Um, do you want to sing a song for us? <sighs> Bologna tastes good with mustard and cheese. Bologna. Yes. I love that song. You're such a good artist. Or a formerly artist, former artist. Yes, yes. That, that, that terrible accent. Conjugating verbs is tough for me. So, um, what do you have there? A giant picture of myself. Oh my god, that gigantic picture of yourself is gorgeous. It's... I know. Dare I say, it's even more gorgeous than in the original, which wow. would be you. Well, this is before I had that horrible stint with uh, the Mountain Dew. Oh, the Mountain Dew. That put me into oh, the, the Betty the Ford Dew. critic. Betty Ford, Wait. Mountain Dew. Betty Dew, Mountain Ford. So, yeah. can I ask you a question? I would much rather interview your picture than you. It, I mean, you understand, of course, don't you? Yeah. It's, 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 no, no, don't, don't take it. No, don't take it the no. Right. no. I'm sorry you had to witness that, whoever you are. Although you, you needed to see that. Um, so, so uh, here he is, the artist formerly known as Dewage. Dewage, Dewage, much better than spewage. <laughs> The crewage. Or sewage. <laughs> Who likes sewage? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know. So, it's a lot better than that. I'm angry at you right now. What? You did not give me a handkerchief when I called for it, but, Mr. Peterson. But there aren't any. They, they all exploded in a fiery accident. Really? It's what do true. I look like? Do I look like Mother Teresa? Do I care? No. Well, actually, you do, sort of. In oh, I do? I really do. Mother Teresa had a beard? Well, yeah. Listen, so in front of, can we please not bicker in front of our guests? I'm no, sorry. I'm sorry. No, you, had okay, to, yes. you had to hear that. Patrick, Patrick Dewich, Dewich the artist formerly known as. Oh, this is wonderful. How do you think he blew up this picture so large? Do you think he has a picture blowing up machine? I don't know. Don't Dewich. talk. I'm mad at you. Thank you. Oh, Dewich. Oh, Dewich. I'd like to sing a song to Dewich. Yeah, me too. Excuse me.
Excuse me, what? Yeah, me too. That's what I thought you said. Two bridges, the guy I like. I don't know why, but whenever I hike, or maybe whenever I ride my bike, I want to bridge. Yes, do it. I want to bridge. Shut up! I'm not talking to you. Do it, I love do it. Ah, do it is my friend. Oh, do it. I'll crush him. I love my accordions. I love the accordions. I'll crush you. Hello, and welcome back to the show. If you've been away, you've missed a hell of a lot, and probably your life is not going to be good. But you probably don't want a good life if you've missed this show. But for those of you who have just joined us, you might be wondering, gee, what the hell is this? And I don't know if I can say hell or not. I probably shouldn't say hell. Oh, hell. So what this is, is a fabulous artistic achievement that has been created from our very own local artist, our friend, not our foe, Mary McCrange. And this is the amazing talking box. So, Mr. Box, yes. or is it Miss? It's Mr. Box. Oh, Mr. Box. How are you today? Well, I'm doing just fine. How are you? Oh, I'm great, I'm great. So, let me ask you, is, is the life of a box hard? Is it difficult? Sometimes it's hard to fit in, Patrick. It really is. Where, where do you try and fit into? Places that you normally don't find a box. Hmm. Perhaps bars? Exactly. Hmm. I've per gotten thrown out of more than a few. Oh no. Yes. Do you feel box discrimination? Sometimes I feel boxed in, Patrick. <laughs> you. Um, now, I, I know this might seem like an awkward thing to ask you, but it seems to me that you radiate a special kind of energy. And if I could just touch you, perhaps caress you, I think that well, we'd both be better for it, if that's okay. A little bit. Okay, just tell me when to stop. Hey, not there! Oh, I'm, I'm, so, I'm sorry. Um, so, what, do you remember your creation at all? No, like most births, I have no recollection. Neither do I. Neither do I recollect most births. But do you, do you go to church, perhaps? Box church? There is a special box church that was just formed here in this town, and I frequent it often. What is the population of talking boxes in the state? Surprisingly, it's very small, Patrick. Oh, really? Yes. Huh. You're not really a talking box at all, are you? What do you mean? What do I mean? What do I mean? Don't try and fool me, spiked man. Super pork. That's right. Go back to your station, please. Play some music for you if you like. That's all you get. Well, that was a wonderful interview with our favorite talking box. Oh my god, it's a moving box now. Are you, are you ever in need of... Oh, wait a second. <clears throat> That's right. The next thing on our show, something we like to call... This is an old piece of paper. Oh, yes. No. <laughs> this is no laughing matter. This is a public service announcement for everyone with three toes. Yes, all you slaws out there. It's been hard living the life that you live, but one thing that you must remember, and please always remember this, is that an elephant never forgets. So, if there's something that you ever forget, it must be that you are a sloth. Thank you, and that has been our public service announcement for today. Now, oh, <laughs> there we are. Are you ever in need of a good joke? If so, please come on down to 1414 18 18 12th Street. And there we have this wonderful, oh my goodness, that's a menu. Are you hungry? Because sometimes hungry people are hungry because they haven't fed their soul. 
You need to feed your soul with soul food. Huh. That was rather... Did you see that? That? Did you, did you see that? Because sometimes I see things that other people do not see. Oh my god! Where? Patrick, Patrick, there's some guy riding a bike around here and I can't find him at all. I don't know where you he is. You don't know where <laughs> that man is? You! Get out of here! Ah, you are. Oh! Well, during this beating, let's have another tune. I thought you were beating this man. I'm trying. That's why I'm playing okay. the song. I'm trying. Eric right. Peterson, okay. Eric Peterson, what do we pay you for? Excuse me. I should say so. Yes, I should. Where's the corner of Fifth and Harris? The corner of Fifth and Harris. Are you trying to get me to reveal our super secret location? No. Because that is where our super secret location, where I'm at right now, is. So I'm close? Yes. You don't want me to reveal my super secret phone number, 5148619, do you? No. I would never do that, 5148619, 514-8619, that never. No, I wouldn't ask. Because we're at the corner of 5th and Harris. No. Yes. Then I'm there. Where'd you get that hat? It's gorgeous. So I'm there. Yeah. You're here. You're always there. I'm always here to you. I'm there. How do I get what? to here from there? How would you get from there to here or here? From no, from here to there. From here to there. That's why I asked in from the first place. Three, two, one, contact. I don't know. Yes? That way, then. That way would be the way to go. Go gently into that good night, my friend. Thank you. Certainly, man with the gorgeous hat. I didn't find him. I can't find him anywhere. Oh, geez. Oh, man, he's a fighter. Oh, I, you try, I can't Eric Peterson, oh, the most boring man on the planet. Oh, man. You try. I'm stepping on this hat, too. Why aren't you wearing this hat? Put that right. Ow. This is the best hat I've ever worn in my life. It makes me feel like I should be hunting right now. Oh, boy, hunting and killing things is so much fun to me when I can go to the grocery store and buy things that are already dead and could eat. Oh boy, this is the best hat I've ever had on my head. I hate this hat. Get it off my head. Get it off my head. Somebody get it off my head. Patrick, the acrobat team is here. Oh, delicious. Um, oh, the acrobat team is here. Hallelujah. Praise the acrobat team. Come on, come on down. Hi. Hi. We're the American Obscure Acrobatic Team. Where are the rest of you? Well, they didn't show up. Oh, well, we're glad to have you here. Would you like to perform some tricks? I would love to. I'm going to have to ask for a partner, though. Okay, go ahead. Actually, there's this guy out in the hall that I saw.